Our Defenders team found out expectant mothers are among the collateral damage left in the wake of an abrupt medical shakeup. As we first reported Friday night, Holston Medical Group opted to dismiss several doctors who resigned in March but had planned to honor scheduled patient visits and contracts through September. In the days since, we found out 35 doctors in all lost their jobs. HMG closed 10 office locations and laid off support staff, blaming COVID-19 for a dramatic reduction in office visits. The defenders Nathan Morabito discovered that decision is leaving pregnant women scrambling to find doctors just days before their babies are due. Talk about bad timing. If it's not already scary enough to have a baby right now, just imagine the same doctor that's helped you for the first 34 weeks of your pregnancy is basically fired and can't deliver your baby. First pregnancy, first baby. Due on April 25th, Hudson Skaggs will already enter an uncertain world. Even with all this going on, my OB had always been very reassuring that everything would be okay. To make matters worse, now the doctor who has guided his parents since the beginning no longer has a job or hospital privileges. Now to know that she's not going to be able to be there, yes is scary and sad. What so. a terrible spot to put you in. All this was kind of blindsiding. 38 weeks pregnant, Allie Skagg says it all came without warning. A Holston Medical Group bombshell that's forcing her and other expectant mothers to scramble for care in their most vulnerable moments. Which obviously does raise the anxiety level for sure. Let's put me in <laughs> very stressful position. Mothers like Brittany Bowden. Yep, she's having a little brother. 34 weeks pregnant with her second child, Hunter. She hasn't seen a doctor in person in six weeks, and now she's having complications. I haven't had a blood pressure check. I haven't had a growth measurement checked. She scheduled an appointment for today with an HMG nurse practitioner, and then her phone rang. 10 minutes from leaving the house, I get a call that they are no longer employed as well. OBGYN nurse Danielle White says the doctors never wanted it to come to this. This is not their call. This is not their choice. They want to take care of their patients and they're not able to. Patients have said, I've had a rough couple of months. They largely learned indirectly of Holston Medical Group's plans to dismiss doctors and staff and close multiple locations. An HMG spokesperson said Monday, the company regrets the information was leaked prior to when patient notification began, telling us that was never the intention. Adding, Holston Medical Group is working to offer any and every path for a patient to address immediate care needs. It just shows the complete lack of care that HMG has. But these patients say the company's actions speak louder than its words. The patients are getting the short end of the stick. Holston Medical Group is now directing patients in need of immediate care to its website. What does HMG say to these patients? A spokesperson said Holston Medical Group knows this is a very difficult situation and understands and shares the concern. Nate Morabito, WCNC Charlotte.